New numbers show that Aurora's photo speed enforcement program costs more than it collects. Now city leaders in Aurora say they've got to make a change. Nine News reporter Brianna Clark is looking into this tonight. Yeah, the pilot program hasn't even been around for a year yet, and already Aurora City Council members say it's just not worth it. And here's why. They shared this graphic at last week's Public Safety Committee meeting. Since June, Aurora has made more than $75,000 off speeding tickets from the photo enforcement program. Sounds like a lot, but that doesn't make up for how much the program costs. More than half a million dollars. Public Safety Vice Chair Steve Sundberg tells me the program looked good on paper, which is why he was all for it at first. But now it's clear it is not worth the cost. It's frustrating. This should have been a program I think that could have, would have worked. It works in Denver. I think our former police chief didn't wrap his arms around it at first, uh, which I think could have got off to a more solid start. Uh, our current interim chief and leadership did embrace it and tried their best to staff it. But uh, disappointing. It's it's ultimately disappointing. We gave it the good old college try. We're going to be looking for other alternatives, and uh, we're going to address this issue of speeding. As of now, he says city council plans to terminate the contract with their current vendor, but not the program completely. So you'll still see those vans out on the roadways. They want to find a way to keep it going in a more cost efficient way, though. They plan to talk about this more at the next public safety committee meeting. Brianna Clark, Nine News. Brianna, thank you.